Jeez, oh. Oh, right up your <laughs> 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 Right up your Right That you don't so thought. <laughs> no, I did that. The sun is shining. Finally, the sun is out in Scotland. It is 2nd of May. What a beautiful day. We have now set the Viking press up outside. Today's pressing day, Viking press, and then close grip bench press and all the accessory stuff. Yeah, so it's going to be fun. It's going to be good. Like I said, this week is just seeing where we are, not pushing too much, just getting the body back into it, and then all guns blazing come next Monday. And also, guys, we're going to be at the Fit Expo, if you don't already know. Come see your favourite Spicy Brothers. We're going to have merchandise. It's going to be great. It's the first time it's Manchester and it's going to rock. So come see us, stay spicy and we'll see you guys there. Let's get on to the session. Bye. Oh, it's hotter than the world, jeez. Give me water, God, give me water. interrupt our program to bring you this important message. Right guys, we are back in the Ready Steady Cook Studio, aka Luke's Kitchen, and look what we've got in front of us. We have just got a delivery from you know who, Hello Fresh, and today we are making red pepper glazed turmula chicken. chicken. So yeah, basically just chicken, but with some added extras, like couscous and all that. So yeah, be prepared, Chef Tom is here, and I've got my assistant Luke, let's do this. So today's video sponsor is HelloFresh. HelloFresh allows you to cook amazing meals without all of the unnecessary stress. With many different choices, from a high protein meal to vegan dishes, it's hard to go wrong with HelloFresh. When you get your HelloFresh box, all of the ingredients are pre-measured. So forget about spending hours in the shops or the hassle of weighing and measuring your ingredients. Just follow the step-by-step -step instructions and watch the magic happen. If you are ready to cook like Big Tom and myself, be sure to click the link in the description or scan this QR code and use code 60 Stoltman and get 60% off your first box and 25% off the next two months plus some free gifts. Guys, we aren't just straw men, we are the strongest cooks in the world. With help from our friends at HelloFresh, we have come up with this genius chicken dish. Guys, use code 60STOLTMAN for 60% off your first box, and then for your next two orders, 
you get 25% off plus some free gifts. So guys, if you want to join up with HelloFresh, be sure to check the link in the description below. It is so easy, so simple. Even Big Tommy and myself made an amazing dish. 60 Stolen for your discount. And now back to your regularly scheduled program. So that was the first session, or first exercise done of the session. I uh, did some Viking press. It felt okay, it felt quite comfy. Because I'm more of like a jerk. I've just got to watch it on double dip, that's my only thing. So yeah, feeling good, as Tom says, nice and sunny outside. So we were gonna do push press, but our wrists and stuff are a bit panged up. Tom's wrist is a little bit swollen still, so in that uh, that position it's quite painful for, for Tom when he's pressing or push pressing. Um, so we decided to do right and press. And now we're gonna go on to do some incline press. A little bit more controlled, so hopefully it shouldn't be too bad on Tom's wrist. And uh, yeah, so stay tuned for the rest of the session. Before that, anyway, I think people see my pressing was uh, very good in the gym. Push press, log, dumbbell. Um, I think the difference this time is I just kept dumbbell in my whole prep, even before the Arnold's. You know, I said to Dan, that's my weakest, I need to keep it in. If I do it every week, 80k, 60k, 100k, it'll be fine. So, yeah, I knew I was good enough for the 136, but that was my easiest lift out of them all, which is good confidence. So, yeah, that's what I'm doing. For this prep, you know, it's not in Royal Albert Hall, but I'll be keeping dumbbell in every week, every second week, just to get the motions for it. So when it does come back, I can just go, you know, and smash it again. Same with log. Log's not in Royal Albert Hall, but we're keeping that in. So yeah, it's just important to keep things in and keep ticking it over, because you know, at the end of the day, we deadlift and we squat and we press every, like, and push press every single week, and that's how you get better at that, and that's how you do get better. So I'm just going to keep everything in. Doesn't matter if it's light, like I said, just for technique and just to keep my body used to pressing a log, pressing a dumbbell, just like I do deadlifts and squat every week. Viking pump. <laughs> Everybody, um, that is our training done. Nice session today. Both Tom and I are feeling uh, really pumped in our shoulders and our front delts. The the Viking press really pushed us. So Tom is away looking after our sister. She's just had twins, so he's going to babysit them quickly. Um, so he had to shoot off. Uh, but good session, good one first time back for pressing. But thank you so much for watching, guys. Appreciate it. Feeling good, first week back. Um, second session and as always please smile stay safe and stay spicy and don't forget to ring that little bell ding 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 tom <laughs> guys so today i'm going to walk you through the walk press hey guys this is week one of the atlas stone tutorial by tom stone right guys today's tutorial is 